morning students since the last two classes we have been learning the story Finn Mackerel and the Giant's Causeway and today we are going to read it out it's the uh, final pages first of all let me read it out Finn's late for his meal i'll serve you his favorite cake in the meantime can you please turn the direction of the house just the fa- way Finn does ben and donna went out and touched the house with his forefinger and it turned around ola was shocked but she remained calm and said thank you the cake is ready but there is no water to wash your hands can you please crack the mountain that is close by and get some water sure said ben and donna as he touched the mountain with his forefinger and split open and water gushed out una realized that all his strength lay in his forefinger the clever wife now had a plan she baked the cake with an iron griddle pressed inside it banadona bite it hungrily and broke three front teeth what kind of cake is this he roared in anger fin relishes it she says it's as soft as butter see even our baby eats it happily would you like to say hello to the baby come with me see him eat Banandana said I am not very good with babies but I'll see him Una took Banandana to the huge baby peeping out from a huge sheet like dress and bonnet he was happily having milk from the bottle a baby is as strong as his father said Una proudly You can put your finger in his mouth to see how much strong his teeth are. As Banadona put his finger in Finn's mouth, he bit off his finger. Banadona screamed that he had been cheated. Now Finn could easily beat him as his strength was all gone. Banadona ran off for his life out of Ireland. Finn thanked his clever wife for her shrewdness as banandona was fleeing finn scooped a huge clod of earth and flung it at the retreating po- giant the clod he flung missed its target and landed in the middle of the irish sea it became the isle of man and both giants tore up the giant's causeway just leaving the wrecked ends at the two shores so students here is the end of these stories now let me give you a short summary of the, the story that we have read today so um una asked ben and donna to just come inside her house and sit down then she told him that Finn will be late for today's lunch and <clears throat> she offered also a cake to Banadona that she told that it is Finn's favorite cake so after a few time una was uh, uh, searching away in order to find out his strength then he came she came out with an idea she told ben and donner to just turn around his sorry their house just the way finn does then ben and donner went outside and he just touched their house with a forefinger and surprisingly the house turned around after seeing this una got shocked and he understood it very well that his uh four fingers are his most important part then again <clears throat> she come up with a new plan to beat this great giant she told that 
she had already finished making the cake but she also informed him that as there is no water in the house so she requested him to just break off the mountain nearby their house and to take out some water from it and banandona surprisingly agreed to her proposal she just touched the mountain with his forefinger and just the water came out of it now una was totally convinced that his strength lies in his forefinger then as una has already prepared the cake with iron griddle pressed inside it now she gave the cake to the giant and as soon as he bit it his three front teeth just broke down and he was very angry he was shouting at una very angrily that what kind of a cake is this but una told him that this is fins favorite cake and he relishes it very much and also said that it this cake is as soft as butter and their baby also likes this cake then una told him that would you like to see our baby then banandona again agreed to her proposal when he went to the uh, inside room he saw that the baby was uh, peeping out from a huge cloth and he was having milk then ban and donner uh, in order to see the strength of the teeth of this baby he just put his forefinger inside his mouth and suddenly the baby means fin bite off his forefinger and then ban and donner just started shouting and he told that he has been cheated now as his all strength has gone now he just ran out from the place and as soon as he was running fin also chasing him behind so what did fin do fin take sorry took a huge lump of earth and he just throw threw on that uh, banana donor but his shot got missed and the lump it fell into the irish sea and as a result there it make it made a new island that is isle of man and at last both the giants uh, they just fight together it's that's why the causeway that had been made by uh, fin earlier that also broke in the middle leaving some cracked shore uh, sorry cracked areas on both the sides of it so students where is the end of this story i hope you have understood it well and now the meanings of the new words that we have got here and they are iron griddle which means a flat round iron plate that is heated on a stove or over a fire and used for cooking the number 2 clod means a lump the number 3 shrewdness the quality of being clever at understanding and making judgments about a situation and the last one rect having an outline an edge or a surface which is not straight or even Now students here is the end of our today's story and this is your home assignment if you can please try to do it by yourself otherwise i am going to give the answers in the next class so as for now thank you so much